So we can also yeah. give the investor the bank guarantee if required for the amount they are investing into our company. Uh, how much amount we are expecting? I am currently expecting around 5 to 7 crore. You are going to give bank guarantee? Yeah, I can give, a, give you a bank Then why don't you try for a debt? Instead of uh, yeah, for that, the problem is my age. Banks are not allowing the, the funds to be you know, allotted to the land. He is just 20 years old. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. 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 They have experience, but this company for me currently is a proprietorship and we have also opened another branch in the US which is in Florida, Miami and the name of that company is Gautam Group USA where India is the head office and that is a branch office in the US and we have another partner office in Dubai which is in Abu Dhabi mostly and fourth is in Brazil, South Africa. So in the span of two years, we did achieve to become a multinational company. But due to the shortage of funds, we are unable to diversify ourselves and spread ourselves more. Any plans in getting in Saudi or something? Yes, we, all, we have an office in uh, Dubai, but we are trying to expand it there also. But Why am I asking? We have someone who uh, has a good connection in Saudi where it can give you investment also, but they want to promote making something. Yes, we can, we can do that. Yes. My ideology is to increase my company, so if it has to be made in Saudi, we will go for it. Then we can take it forward. And if required, I can get a standby lot of credits of up to, because I'm expecting another standby lot of credit for a face value of $53 million from Barclays Bank, London, which will arrive on first week of January. So on that case, I would require this year, or a tech, or investment. Sanjeevji, uh, Sanjeevji? Yes, Swaranji, bolie. Yeah, we can uh, look into this. We have Bacon Saudi partner. We can uh, take uh, take them to the Saudi, uh, invest in them, and as well as grow them uh, to other uh, Eastern mass markets. Okay, I will connect. You have my email. Let me WhatsApp. I will sure. connect both of you. Okay, thanks. I think that was going to ask you. Yeah. Can't hear you. Sir, you are mute. Uh, in fact, uh, uh, this. Uh, uh, I can facilitate some investment from Gujarat also. I need to understand the concept a little better, uh, especially. Okay. Uh, the revenue model, uh, so there should, uh, there could be many takers for the project in uh, uh, Gujarat. Anyway, Sanjeev, uh, uh, coordinate. I, I, I will connect both of you. Uh, you can connect to both of us uh, at a mutually convenient time, so that let me understand the concept better. And I think there could be few. Uh, I mean, quite a few. Uh, I mean, uh, prospective investors in Gujarat. All right, so one question because uh, while Swanand asked that, my recording was off for a certain time. Who are the co founders and all that? Can you just explain for the sake of getting that on record here, please? Uh, yeah, so one co founder for my company is my uncle who has nearly 30 to 40 years of. He has also worked with companies like Import to Oils in India where they import 
crude uh, sunflower oil from Russia or Ukraine and then they refine it in the refineries of India. There's a refinery in Bangalore whose capacity is 15,000 metric tons per month. So that is also a project that he has worked on. And his experience has actually helped us to step up our company and getting clients easily. And internationally, we are operating with 40 people internationally in order to get clients and to execute the projects. All right. So that's it. Uh, we are well so Sanjeev, uh, you can coordinate and uh, I'll go through the presentation. Uh, uh, I mean, uh, I'll devote a little time to go through the presentation before we get connected to each other. Yeah, so yeah. that... Uh, yeah, I will. Uh, my, I will my understanding of the subject would be better so that he, before somebody, so that I am in a position to explain the concept uh, uh, to the prospective investor a uh, little better. Yeah. Thereafter, of course, uh, they can uh, carry on. Yeah. But mm -hmm. uh, every time he talks to me, it's in a million dollars only. So I used to get scared a lot. Uh, but he is backed by his uncle who understands his business. Plus, he also has good grip, as you can, as you must have heard him. So I'm pretty sure uh, I will send the presentation as well as connect both of you. Then post mm. that, I'm pretty sure, you know, when you connect, you can have follow-up meetings and whatever you need, deep dives and whatever bank guarantees that he has promised. Once you are in possession of that and you should, and you have investors who can help him for the short-term thing that he, that's what he uses the money to get the uh, business going. That part is taken care of. I mean, just win-win uh, for every one of you. All right. Thank you, uh, Paul, and uh, thank you to our panel of experts and mentors. It was a nice session today we had. And, uh, uh, you know, uh, we finished it on time. The best part is that <laughs> we... No, I think I have a small uh, suggestion, uh, yeah, yeah. sir. Many other such panels where I have attended or I continue to attend. In fact, uh, you know, uh, uh, roughly 10 to 15 minutes is given for the presentation because ultimately more time should be given for the purpose of interaction between yeah. the presenter and also the panel. Yeah. 